CRC Evans presents the internal welding machine. The internal welder is a mechanical, electrical and pneumatic device that is used to align and weld pipe from within. The clamping shoes rise, holding the pipe in place, while the torches deposit the root bead. Pneumatic drive, wheels and brakes propel and stop the internal welder. The internal welder propels itself to the end of the pipe and stops automatically. The internal welder is aligned with the pipe end and clamped in place. This action also aligns the internal welder's torches with the beveled pipe end. The rear clamping shoes extend centering the internal welder in the pipe. The next piece of pipe is moved into position. Control of the internal welder now comes from the reach rod control box. All of the internal welder's connections are located on the reach rod control box. Power for the torches, the RRCB, the batteries, argon, and compressed air are attached. The wafer switch is turned to CW weld. This activates the CW torches and purges the gas. To begin the weld, the operator presses and holds the weld start button. This initiates the CW weld cycle. As the CW torches deposit the rubied, the CCW torches are moved into position. When the weld is finished, the operator moves the wafer switch to the CCW weld position and again begins the CCW weld cycle by pressing the weld start button. Upon completion of the CCW weld cycle, the operator moves the wafer switch to retract shoes. The internal welder's clamping shoes will retract, resting the internal welder on its glide wheels. The operator moves the wafer switch to home, then selects auto travel, activating the pneumatic drive wheels, and starting the entire weld cycle over again. 